Settings. Somehow you've ended up with an iPhone or an iPad that won't stop talking and you can't work out how to get into settings to turn this thing off. Let's find out how to shut this thing up. This is Dave's Tech Rescue where I solve your problems with computers, internet and technology. If you have a question you'd like to ask me, leave it in the comments below and I'll do my best to answer it. And remember to subscribe so you don't miss my next video where I might be answering your question. Today's question, I've accidentally turned on voiceover on my iPad, how do I switch it off? I help out a couple of blind and partially sighted people with their tech and without voiceover they wouldn't be able to use their iPads at all. But if you've turned on voiceover by accident it becomes a nuisance, making the iPad really noisy and difficult to control. Turning off voiceover is quite tricky because you don't just need to know where the setting is, you need to learn a whole new way of controlling your device. So here's what you need to know. Tap once to select an item and voiceover will read out what's under your finger. To actually press what you see, you need to double tap. And if you need to scroll through a list, you need to scroll with three fingers. With these three things in mind, let's turn off voiceover. Tap on settings, then double tap to open it. Tap on general, then double tap to open it. Tap on accessibility, then double tap to open it. Then tap on voiceover, and double tap to open it. Now you can tap on the voiceover switch, and double tap to turn it off. Now you can press the home button to go back to the home screen. What a relief! Let me know in the comments if this video helped you. Does your iPhone or iPad do anything else that really annoys you? Tell me about it in the comments below and I might just make a video to help you out. Like my video showing you how to stop Siri appearing whenever you hold down the home button. If you'd like to see more videos from me in future, please hit the red subscribe button and don't forget to give this video the thumbs up. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.